Hello and welcome to the Rugged Rock Hound. Today we are cutting a whole bunch of rocks. All kinds of things, geodes, wood, whatever. Let's see what we got. We'll start off with a nice little Dugway geode. Oh, that's a pretty nice one actually. Look at that. Good lines, patterns, colors. Not too bad. Here we've got some more bird's eye, the shells. Oh, that's a good shell. Look at that. Nice chambers in that one. Very nice. Here we have a nice little limestone rock that Tim found on the uh, Nephi Banded Onyx one. This was in the stream we checked lower. And we got some good fossils in there. Mostly crinoids. Cool. Very nice. Here we have a piece of petrified wood. Had a lot of fractures in it, and sure enough, the other side fell apart, but this side managed to stay together it's got good textures in it but the color is not good now this is an interesting little rock this is actually some emerald from brazil that i got many many years ago they're mostly just stream pebbles that it's low low grade but if we cut it interesting i mean you can see the green in it but you can tell it's it's a very low grade here we have just a weird piece that came from dugway Thought I'd cut it open. Well, look at that. Get some nice rhyolite in there. Kind of makes an interesting, cool pattern. This is a rock I found on one of the trips. I don't remember where it came from. But it's interesting. It's mostly calcite with a little bit of, like, red jasper in it. Or maybe some agate. And then, like, green volcanic rock. Interesting stuff. Here I have some more of the... Uh, stuff that you get from Cisco and Yellowcat. Got some red agate here. Wait, what? Huh. Doesn't look anything like the outside. Instead it's this kind of bleh tan. Barely any red. What? <laughs> it happens sometimes. There's a very large limonite crust cluster that didn't turn out so well. It was really broken all over. And... Oh, we got some pirate at the top. The rest, nothing. Here we have a little piece of Wonderstone. I believe this one's from Salina. Oh, yeah, definitely with those browns. <laughs> interesting. Not the best. I have better. But that is still a very interesting piece. Here's another nice little dugway. Oh, that's nice. Oh, look at the bands in that one. That has a lot more bands than I normally see from Dugway. Very good. Another little piece of petrified wood. Oh, nice. Oh, that has some good color in it. Oh, that is really nice. And good patterns. Yeah, I like that one. Here, I have some more pyrite. Oh, that one is mostly pyrite. <laughs> it doesn't look the best when it's mostly pyrite. It's better when it has more things going on in it. Still interesting. Here's a little piece of jasper. Don't remember where this came from. Oh, very pink. And with those dendrites, maybe it came from the, the little Moab area, the chimney rock. Maybe. Here's another piece of agate. Interesting. Got some bands in it. Not the best color, but it does have some interesting bands going through it. All right. Final one for today is some Picasso marble. And, ooh, oh wow. Look at that. Oh, that's beautiful. The stuff is so neat. The webbing going through it is just amazing. You can imagine it's like trees this way. Like a spooky forest. <laughs> Very cool. That's it for today's episode. Whole bunch of good looking stuff. I really hope you enjoyed it and I hope to see you on the next one. Until next time, remember, there is treasure everywhere.